know that zone. You know it well. You love it. Our next guest, multi platinum Grammy, award winning music and entertainment icon at this point. Hits like hot in, but they put a pronouncer, her. Pronouncer, her. It's hot in her. It ain't, her. It ain't here. It's hot in here. Her. Country grandma, ride with me. It just kept us going over the decades. That's now. right. And tomorrow <laughs> night, you can see him on the 2021 BET Hip Hop Awards, being honored for his 22 year and mm. counting music career. So please, everyone, welcome legend and superstar <laughs> Nelly. Nelly, thank you for being with us. We were just talking about how young you look. Hard to believe you've had 22 years. Uh, under your belt as a professional, but um, how are you feeling about this award? Pretty remarkable. Yeah, man. I mean, you know, it's a little bit overwhelming. You think it, it didn't? It doesn't seem that long. It doesn't. But I guess <laughs> when you think about it, yeah. Uh, even though I may look uh, a little bit underaged, <laughs> I don't feel it. <laughs> You're the 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 youngest looking icon and legend yeah. probably uh, out there. But my man, you. How do you, and, and so many artists out there now, they might have a good run. A good run these days is a, is a couple of years or maybe even one hit. You, you haven't just been around. You have been making hits and stayed relevant. How, how are you able to do what so many just could only dream of? I think, uh, you know, you, you work hard. It's a testament to my fans as well. You know what I mean? Um, they've allowed me to have a a wonderful career man they've allowed me to try new things and not be afraid to go to new places and and, and you know um try to uh, spread yourself out as much as possible so um just trying to keep busy man uh I, I, a little bit of luck and a lot of hard work yeah well you have been busy you just dropped a country album called heartland which debuted at the top of the country charts, I may uh well point out you <laughs> have been uh, a pioneer in finding a way to, to be relevant in hip hop, relevant in country, and, and embraced by both genres. How do you think you did that? And, and how did you have the notion to do that? I think it just started when um, in the beginning of my career, um, just making sure that none of my music sounded like as I, as I was coming out. I wanted it to be different. And um, when I started, even with Country Grammar, before um, tip, me and my Tim McGraw collaboration came about, I was finding out that I was getting a lot of a lot of bookings for for like festivals and and and, and country, country uh, <laughs> different events, and I was just like, whoa! I, I wasn't really paying attention to it like that at first because I thought it was happening to everybody. <laughs> Come to find out, it wasn't happening to everybody. It was just <laughs> happening to me. So I would go from one show where uh, Tim McGraw might be headlining, and then the next day I would be doing another show where DMX may be headlining, and it was just <laughs> like, wow, it was amazing. We can't wait to see what you keep on doing. Mm -hmm. Nellie, thank you so much for being with us. We appreciate it. Thank you so much. I appreciate you guys. Thank you. Yeah, let everyone know the BET Hip Hop Awards premiere. It happens tomorrow night on BET. All right. Yeah, I saw you nodding there. That he he acknowledged. creative right? genius. Yeah. He, he was saying post-COVID. It's hard to say post-COVID. Yeah. not quite there yet. It's lasting too long. Yeah. <laughs> we're, and we're still in it. Yeah, we well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.